absolutely pierce them and it hurts a lot. Oh my god, this is a genius product. I'm tripping balls. It's so weird. It's Lauren, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another TikTok made me buy it video because I love shopping and I love TikTok. And those two weaknesses together create this lovely video. I'm also back as uh, your guinea pig, your test subject to decide if these products are actually worth buying or if we as a collective are just buying them because TikTok said so. So this is a dress. <laughs> This is a dress. This is a dress. It's still a dress. It's supposed to be a dress. It's going to be a dress. This dress is $29.99 and has 23.4 million views on TikTok. I mean, it's Lauren Wolf. I feel like Lauren Wolf is the fashion slash Amazon uh, fashion influencer of all influencers. It looks really cute on her. I'm just nervous that I won't be able to tie it the way she did. Where's the top? Okay, oh, here's the top, here's the top. And then we've got all of this to work with for wrapping. I think there's a high chance this could look cute. And also low key, I think this comes in white and could make a very just like sassy mummy costume for Halloween. October 2022, if you see this dress again in another video, just smile and nod, just smile and nod. This is a lot. <laughs> And I think we're gonna struggle through this together. Okay, so I feel one, like a spider. This is what this is giving. And so I've got four layers of ties here. It's kind of also just like the stress of having like, obviously I've got shorts underneath, but like the stress if you were gonna wear this, how do you go to the bathroom? Because then you'd have to completely retie yourself up like a mummy. I think this is maybe one of those dresses that looks better on camera from just the front. <laughs> but see, I can already just tell this is gonna look like ass from the back, okay? Okay. I'm really nervous to see what the back looks like. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I think I do know. I know. Update, I wanted to put up a good fight and I just put in a valiant effort. This is, I think, the best that I can do and it definitely looks better. We've got this fun little knot that I worked really hard on. I was looking at some of the Amazon photos and everyone is struggling with the same parts that I am. So this is a very DIY spirited dress. So just prepare yourself. <laughs> This next one I feel like is the most recent viral product that I've been influenced to purchase. So the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip I think is an older product and this one is more of a bomb. But the one that's gone super viral is the Lip Plump, which is supposed to be a full coverage lip gloss. We can do a little comparison just like on the back of my hand swatch, but then obviously I'll wipe all of my current lip product off so we can give her a real test. I got the color Mixed Berries, which I feel like was the best match for the lip liner that I normally wear, but like all the beauty gurus have given it the, like the seal of approval, the TikTok of approval. I trust in the beauty influencers and here I am being influenced. This product is $21 and has 13.4 million views from just one, like that's like the most viral TikTok that I found. I'm sure like collectively, this product has an insane, insane amount of views and Tarte right now, their stock prices soaring. Okay, so here's the balm, which we already know is going to be pretty sheer. I also have lip products stained on my hand from two days ago. And like, I'm a hygienic individual. I've had two showers since then. That's pretty nice. Here's the full coverage plum. I mean, it's definitely more covered. It feels really hydrating. I'm excited to try it. I'm gonna put lip liner on like the way that I normally would to see if it like gives the same coverage as my other lip products do. Here we go. Not quite the right color, but that's on me. Mm. Oh, it feels nice. Oh, that's pretty good. I thought that it was gonna be way less coverage than that. I can't see my natural like lip irritation from just having scrubbed the shit on my lips. Like it definitely covered it. I'm like trying to not get too tight because I feel like you guys don't need to see like every pore, but pretty impressive. I am, <laughs> this product is so stupid. I am the target demographic for products like this. This is a spoon holder and steam releaser. And it's no secret that I suck at cooking and I don't actually spend much or any time in the kitchen. But did I need 
this little crab spoon holder that attaches to the side of your pot. No. Did I still buy it? Yes. And I am so excited to like maybe just make some like plain nudes or something today so that I can try this out because it is so adorable that it makes my insides explode into a thousand little Mr. Krabs loving pieces. And I'm so excited. And for $19.95, you too can have a spoon holding crab. I need to get some hobbies. I really need to get some hobbies. This TikTok has 4.4 million views and I'm so glad that this product and TikTok found me within their algorithm because I am the consumer for products like this. Okay, a couple things before we put them in action. One, I'm screaming at this description. For this fearless crustacean, semen bubbles are like a day at the spa, and red, capitalized, is ready to lend a helping claw. So Jeremy argued that we have this stupid thing, which like, boring. Why would you have that when you could have this. Also, he spins, and so we're trying to figure out why he spins. But if any of my uh, culinary professionals, Miss Remy Ashton, looking at you, want to let me know why he spins, please do tell. Oh god. Oh god. I definitely probably should have done this before I had boiling water here. Okay, and so I think he rotates because this is like spoon holder. This is steam cutter. Okay, ready? Ready? Worth $20. Hands down. He's adorable. Oh my God, look at him go. Look at him go. I'm gonna go buy another one. <laughs> I absolutely died at this TikTok. It has 5.3 million views, and it's not the product that you think is about to um, be revealed, but did I already own the product in this video and am here to endorse it and provide other options because I have a multitude of neck and head problems? Yes! For just $28.99, you too can fix your tech neck problems. My uh, physiotherapist literally told me that I think my head hangs eight pounds in the wrong direction going this way because I sit like this all day. But I just want you to know that I have this one. I've got this one, which I also really like. We've got, you know, like a little, a little spiky situation here. And then you can graduate up to this one if you really want to feel the pain where you literally just like rest your two big muscly thingies behind your neck that wrap all the way over your head. You just absolutely pierce them, you skewer them with this, and it hurts a lot. It's a hurt that reminds you of your mistakes. Moose's favorite thing to do is disturb the neck rehab. Bobby's, you're kind of already blocking the shot. <laughs> so it goes here, oh, and then you just get to lay like this, and it's so nice until Moose comes and breathes his hot breath in your face. I am so excited for this product. Like this was made for bitches like me. These are the Lazy Readers. These are only $12.99 and the most viral TikTok had 7.6 million views. Read at a 90 degree angle. I didn't realize that they're um, meant for reading. <laughs> I just assumed they were for watching TV. Yeah, so multi-purpose. Versatile. Here's what they look like. They're so ridiculous and I am so excited. But honestly, this is not the first time that I just like am down to sacrifice the aesthetic for the functionality because right now I'm looking at my crotch. <laughs> we'll have to give it like a true test on the couch. Also, is it getting stuck in my extensions? But like the premise is that I could be horizontal and still be watching TV or Reading. Oh my god, so the only issue with these is that you can't see where you're actually looking. So your butthole's directly on me. <laughs> Rehabbing the neck. Enjoying, oh my god, this is incredible. Oh, this has solved so many problems. I know that I look really, really cool right now. Wow, this is so nice. Oh my god, this is a genius product. I feel like my brain is aligned with the person who developed this product because it's for people like us, like-minded individuals, like-minded lazy individuals. I want to give a warning to my fellow tryptophobia 
having viewers because I'm a little concerned that this mask is a poor mask and the results that I've seen on other TikTokers are pretty insane and like a little, they make me a little bit itchy. So trigger warning, potentially for my tryptophobia havers, this may not be the face mask for you. So this is the Caudalie, ca Caudalie? It's French, so I, I should probably know this, but Caudalie? I don't know. Instant detox mask that tightens pores, remove excess oil, purifying clay, coffee, and grape. This thing apparently works absolute miracles. She's pricey. She's $39.99. And the top TikTok has 10 million views. And so the stocks of Caudalie Paris are also soaring. Okay, here we go. Makeup is off. And obviously this is gonna be just like a very immediate review. Cause obviously I won't know if it fixes just like my entire life. I always start with a brush and just end up swapping back here. Oh, this is so much better. I saw a lot of comments of people who said that their mask did not look like what some of the viral videos have looked like. I feel like these TikToks have all implied that like wherever you have all those like holy patches is where it's like cleaning your pores the most. Again, I got this off a of TikTok and not a dermatologist or an esthetician. Oh my God, I can see my pores already. Take this with a grain of salt. I'll be back in 10-ish uh, minutes. I feel like this is, oh yeah, five to 10 minutes. This shit's drying quick. Oh my god, the tryptophobia warning needs to be so real right now. I can't even look at myself. I'm disgusted. <laughs> my skin is so taut. I feel like I have the little holes everywhere. Like, I would say my most pory areas would be like right here, but I kind of just have them everywhere. I'm gonna zoom in. I'm so sorry, this is kind of revolting, but I wanna give you guys the tea. <gasps> Oh, can you see these holes? I'm just covering my mouth because my mouth looks really weird when I talk without moving my face. Oh God, the nose, the nose pores. So yeah, I mean, I would definitely say this is aligned with where my like most pory areas are. I just feel like all of these masks kind of feel nice when they're like taut or whatever. You know what? I don't know. I need to get this off my face. I can't look at the holes any longer. Like, do you think they're soaking extra things up of my pory areas? Let me know. Also, like I said, there's gonna be no immediate payoff of my skin looking any kind of improved state after this. So like, I feel like I don't really need to show you my skin afterwards. It's not gonna look any different because no miracles are fixed within the span of a 10 minute mask. But overall, am I satisfied? Yes. Yeah. I just happened to literally get this dress in the mail today on the day that I'm filming this. Like the, the timing could not have been better. And I was so surprised and excited by receiving this package because I had genuinely forgot that I ordered it maybe three months ago, which is like the best kind. Of, it's basically like a present. It's like a reward. So this is a dupe of a $600 dress that has been coined the breakup dress on TikTok. And this is the $25 version. Honestly, I'm really excited to try it on. Do the straps look like they were plucked directly from the craft section at Michael's. Yes. Do my boobs look like the boobs on the model of this dress? No, but do I still have high hopes? Yes. This TikTok has 11.9 million views at the time of filming and there's a handful of girls that have also tried the dupe of this on and everyone looks hot as shit and so I'm hoping that I can just add myself to that category. It's got such a weird shift of color. Like you can see it like kind of looks yellow right there but then you go one direction and then it's got like red happening. Can you see what I can see on here? I'm tripping balls. Oh my God, oh my God. It's so weird. But we'll see what she looks like on. Oh my God, see this whole bottom is yellow now. What the f is going on? This is what you get for spending $25 and not $600. Okay, it's actually so pretty, but I'm so confused. You know what, it's not that I'm confused, it's that the dress is confused. I'm gonna put you down so you can see, so you can see. We've also got Bubby's Tippy Tappies incoming. So like, it's actually really cute. It's a little bit big, like I definitely have like too much everywhere. The straps, even though they aren't adjustable, they're actually not in the worst position if I just like adjust them a little bit like pull towards the neck. So it's pretty cute, but like, look at the confusion. It's so weird. If I have any experts that have majored in textiles and wanna tell me what the f is going on, my theory is that it's got something to do with like whatever the base material is, like woven underneath of it. But like, would I recommend it? If you're okay with a little color confusion, it's a really pretty dress. This is an extra small, so definitely size down. If you can, because I would need to get this tailored. But with a little color confusion in mind, I would recommend. 
This one comes from TikTok that only has a million views, but if you're only gonna buy one thing and you have a dog, make it be this product. So it's $45 and it's called the Population Uh Oh Puppy Kit. This is what it looks like. It is absolutely adorable. They've got a spot for you to put your dog's photo. Basically, it's like a panic kit and a guide for all the things you can do if something goes wrong. You've got a whole bunch of like non-emergency medications and you've got hydrogen peroxide, which you can give a dog that will like immediately make them yak up whatever they ate that they're not supposed to have eaten. But it's just like such a valuable product to have in your house. I feel like there's been so many times where I'm panicking and Googling and this is such an incredible resource to have. They've got directions, they've got dosage sizes, they've got quick information, they've got like when to call the emergency vet, what the symptoms, the uses, the purposes, the amounts, assess the situation, wait for results, all the things that a dog parent should genuinely have in their household that could probably save so many people from emergencies. There's so much crucial information here that I think can help dog parents in moments of potential emergencies or being able to decide if you're actually having an emergency because like trying to find the emergency like vet hotline while also trying to like stick your hand down your dog's mouth to grab the kinder egg that moose may or may not have eaten one year at Christmas. Would have loved to have this on hand. So I can't recommend this enough. It's only $45, which is literally nothing for like the peace of mind and safety of having an emergency Popo kit. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will have links to all of the items shown in this video in the description box below. I will see you on Tuesday for a new episode of Wild Till 9 over on the vlog channel and again next Sunday for another video. Bye guys!